So I recorded three videos today. That's crazy. Don't, don't play with it, don't be the size. Good morning, everybody. We are officially going to the dentist today to get new um, wires as well as new color. So let's go. We're changing the wires today. Huh? We're changing the wires. Gonna wait for doctor. Maybe yes. Maybe okay. yes. We'll see. Okay. Sure. I don't even know what I tried to do. I'm tired. All right, so we just finished doing our teeth, and we have our new. We just finished doing our teeth. We just finished our orthodontist appointment, and we have new colors. And I have two different wires. So they changed my top wires, and they changed my bottom wires today. Um, basically, when you do that, your teeth just get tighter, but it doesn't feel bad. So I have black on the top and purple on the bottom. So that's what I look like. All right, let me go. It's hot in this car, y'all. I gotta eat something. Hey y'all, welcome back to another outfit of the day. Today's outfit is this cute dress from Target. It actually is a skirt, yes. And I just have on my Adidas Sambas. My scent of the day is this Nest Indian Jasmine. Like it. Just too cutesy. You guys, hello. Welcome back to the vlog. Um, I have no idea what we're even recording today, but I just look super cute. I do need to go back to school shopping, so that might be something I do today for sure. Um, we are literally just heading to work and my hand is resting on top of my Stanley Cup lid. There are new Stanley Cup lids that I'm probably going to get off of Amazon because they have the lids where you can close it up. And I also may get another cup, y'all. Don't come for me with the cups. And I mean, honestly, wow. it's a support cup, you know? Um, I thought I was going to be early today. I've been up since 5 o'clock. I did a whole facial routine. I literally recorded three TikTok videos. I don't know who I am, but that's who I was today. So I woke up at five o'clock this morning and then I literally was just awake. So I was like, let me get up. I did, I recorded, I made Jonathan like turkey, bacon, eggs, and toast. And then after I did that, I was like, let me go get ready. So I did my facial routine on for TikTok. I'm gonna record that, I mean, edit it today. Then after that, I did a um, get ready with me with like my face. And then I recorded my outfit. So I recorded three videos today. That's crazy. I've been getting a lot of compliments lately with people saying that I look pretty and I think it has something to do with my hair. I'm not gonna lie to you because my hair is blonde and I feel like with my skin and the blonde hair, it sticks out a little bit more. Like, I feel like 
Like I just look well put together. I've been intentionally putting myself together, um, which I normally would do anyway. But the past two days, if you saw my TikTok yesterday, I had on like this blue romper and I had my hair put in a bun. Anytime you put your hair in a bun, especially with braids, it just, I feel like elevates your look because your hair is so far up. And um, I feel like it takes out or brings out your face, like my features. And then today I put my hair back again, second day, I put my hair back out of my face and I got another compliment, another lady said that I look so pretty. So I was like, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I mean, I appreciate anytime anybody tells me that I look pretty. Um, I just think it's like a sweet thing to say. And I appreciate that because I do take a lot of time and effort to make myself look together. Even though my nails are looking hot holes right now, my God. My nails are looking so bad, I'm not gonna show you. So we are headed into work and we have a short work week this week, we have three days and I, there's so much stuff to do at my job that if I start thinking about it, I'll stress myself out like Saturday morning at, at what time was it? I don't know, four o'clock in the morning, maybe I had a nightmare that you know my school wasn't ready and it was actually insane. So I just, I don't want that nightmare. I just, I want, I'm not an end, but that means well. I just want everything to be ready for the first day of school. We only have like two weeks until we go back for like our summer institute and then after that it's like and i am looking at chelsea and i literally i'm ready for fall i'm ready for fall y'all i don't know why i am so ready for fall but literally i am so ready for fall i forgot i had my oh i was talking to y'all all this time and i don't know what the sound quality is going to be like because i forgot i had a microphone this dji is up all right so i just put my microphone on because i feel like it's way better and more clear oh my god chelsea has so many perfumes um oh sorry y'all i just feel so happy y'all i'm vlogging again what is happening um oh sorry i forgot that i had this microphone on. i'm literally vlogging again uh because i just have been in such a tiktoky place uh by the way we're almost at 900 followers on tiktok yeah and we're about to hit a thousand i've been gaining maybe like 20 or so a day i mean if you want to follow me on tiktok go follow me over there in a second i'm about to do self-drive because yeah i haven't done it in a while last time i did it they i, I did it one time and then they just were breaking too hard for me i was like why are you breaking like that when the car they could have sped up and they chose to break and it was just a crazy time but anyway yeah um yeah, I'm in such a good place right now. I don't know. I have a vlog that's supposed to come out for a travel vlog. I'm praying to God that it comes out on Sunday. I think I'm going to hire an editor. So I don't know. I just feel like I need... If I can just continue to produce more content, if I can just continue to, like... I don't know, like, just produce more content. I just want to produce more content. And I feel like I am going to do that on both my YouTube and my TikTok platforms. And yeah, if I can produce two videos a week, which I know I can do because we talk about this all the time. If I've done Vlogmas, then I could do this. Uh, I just have to edit it like Andrea, I forgot her last name, but she's always saying like, edit the same day, don't wait. And I feel like that is how I can produce more content. And if I can find a day, like if I'm like, okay, if you're gonna post on Sundays, then you have to post on Sundays. Like that's what I have to do. So I feel like once I figure out exactly what I'm doing, it's gonna be better for me right now. I'm kind of like all over the place. And I don't know if I told you this already in this vlog because I'm just like randomly talking to you, but I'm ready for fall. Like, I think I just said that, but I am so ready for, I'm ready to go to Home Goods and look at all the freaking pumpkin things. I am ready to go back to school shopping, even though it's August. Um, I'm ready to go back to school shopping for myself because I work in a school and I always go back to school shopping for myself, but I'm also ready to go back to school shopping for Jonathan because I just want him to have like the cutest little outfits. So I'm excited for him as well. Just, I'm ready to go back to school shopping and i know i'm going to probably spend a good amount of money so i got to pay down my cards because we're about to use them up um yeah so yeah y'all that's i mean i really don't have much to say i'm just chatting it up because i feel like i haven't talked to youtube in a while and we are almost at i think we're at 12 something 1200 something subscribers now on youtube and i started a new instagram i think i told you that i have a new intro i've been just like taking tips and stuff from TikTok to see if I can get my um, watch time up. So yeah, I feel like if I do, I don't know. I have a lot of things in my mind. I have a lot of things in my mind. My brain is all over the place. I feel like I have ADHD even though I don't have ADHD. 
Um, I just was like, mm, that's cool. And I think a part of it just because I'm happy to talk to you. So, I will right now talk to y'all later. I don't know what's going to happen today. I've been talking to y'all for three minutes and 29 seconds. Oh my God. All right. I will talk to y'all later. All right. Love you. Bye. So I'm trying to get back into my YouTube bag. Pray for me. I'm trying my best, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna get back into it. Y'all got the real ball version of me. My scarf, my robe, but y'all always see me like this, so it's not really a big deal. I just haven't been on lately. You order breakfast, it's Saturday by the way. Happy Saturday, and I'm just waiting for it to come so I can eat. And yeah, that's it. I'll be back in a minute. Hey y'all, welcome back to a quick little outfit of the day. I'm using this mic because the camera is kind of far away and I wanna make sure y'all can hear me. But this dress is from Target, y'all. So I saw, I think one of the girls, her name is Anaya, I think it's her name, on TikTok. Thank you to you. She literally wore like this outfit on one of her videos and it looks super cute. So I just have this dress from Target. I think this was on sale for like $12, maybe, maybe max 20. Just wanted to show you my cute outfit of the day. Bye. Y'all, don't tell me. I was talking to y'all for like 15 minutes and you were not even here. <laughs> okay. Um, so we're at Target right now. We're just in the drive up. I have to pick up the skirt that I got from this morning. Um, it's starting to rain again, so I just switched it from pick up to drive up just to make it easier for myself. It always takes a while for this Target for some reason. Like, I don't know. We're just waiting for somebody to come. All I got is a skirt and a drink. Nothing too crazy out here, but it's nasty out. I have so many bags. I have a skirt and a jacket, like a jean jacket and a like crap top and a dress. I think just like things that are fall transitional pieces, which is fine. And I actually like this, this dress is also from Target, but I'll show you that in my outfit of the day a little bit later. Tell me why I went to Lush and I sprayed on like the peach spray. Um, it's called Peaches. When I tell you I can't stop sniffing my, I sprayed it in like the crux of my elbow and I can't stop sniffing it. It smells like cinnamon i don't even know what the notes are if you're a fruity person like a fruity gourmand sweet edible i smell like a peach right now like a like peach cobbler like a peach pie and i'm gonna get the other one like something let the good times roll or whatever and that one's supposed to be like a cinnamon so i'm gonna get that one as well but this peach spray Nobody's talking about this one. I don't know. I haven't seen this on TikTok anywhere, but I'm going to tell you right now that this peach spray is amazing. If you are a fruity, sweet girl, you're going to love this one. Yeah. So I'm about to do that right now. I'm literally just, I was going to go into Target. I smelled this on my arm multiple times and I switched it. Hold on, this guy's coming out. We just picked up my order. Now we're going back to the mall because that's how good that is. Lush, count me in. I went to the mall literally and left and now I'm going back. Let's do it. Come with me back to school shopping. We had to start off at Abercrombie and Fitch because what I thought I was going to do was return these pants I got in December of 2023. Don't judge me. Okay, so now I was like, let me try on these slim pants because I have a pair, but I think they were too big. And I ended up trying them on in a size 6 medium or a size 28. Look how these pants fit me all. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see how it's fitting my waist? No gap, no nothing. This is me in the pants from the front. Ignore my feet. I can't put my feet flat on the ground. Okay, so now we're at Coach and I had to go pick up some accessories and the clogs that y'all saw the other day. Yeah, I got those in black, but I will do a haul to show you everything I got from Coach. Now I was heading over to Lush. I was like, let me go to Lush because I want to see what the let the good times roll. I've been seeing everywhere. And of course, Kyra put a video out. So I was like, let me go to Lush today and see. First of all, you know already if you've been to Lush before how good it smells inside this Sagot store. So I walked around, I was looking at everything, and then I ended up finding Let the Good Times Roll literally empty. I'm going to see if they order it by Friday, but then I bought this because it was great. Okay, so now we're at Adidas. I don't know. I was trying to figure out different color waves of Sambas that I was going to wear or I might be interested in, but I didn't really see anything besides the red. Then I went to Gap and look how cute this is. This dress is so freaking cute. And I was wearing it with my Sambas. Yeah, it's perfect. Okay, bye.
So how did I get back at this mall again? Well, basically one of my coworkers was like, that Abercrombie jacket, you have to go back and get it. And I was like, what jacket are you even talking about? And then I was like, oh, this one. This is the denim trench jacket from Abercrombie. I cannot find this thing online. I looked, trust me, it's not there. But I went in store and I found it and I had to get an extra, extra small because it runs kind of big, just so you know. So make sure you definitely size down. But I, I couldn't leave this. Look at this thing, it fits perfectly. So then after that, I was like, I need some blazers. We went into Banana Republic. This is, I haven't been here in years, literally. And the store is so aesthetically pleasing. Like everything is organized. I love this place. I ended up looking at this black blazer and I was like, it's a little big. I don't want it to fit me like that. And then this cream blazer that was too big. It's like a size two and four or four and zero or two and zero. But I wanted this. I didn't get it. Now I look back. I probably should have got that. Then I went to Mango and this is the first time I've ever been to Mango. And when I tell you that the people that work here were so very nice and the store is just a vibe like look at the aesthetics of this i know all about aesthetics i ended up getting this black blazer because i loved it i was like yes then we went to j crew and i was looking for a schoolboy blazer and i ended up finding it it's in a tan color i really just want to buy more pieces that are very good quality and that will last me a longer time instead of buying like cheap ones but yeah i ended up getting a schoolboy blazer in this color bye so we're back and we are going to do the impromptu coach haul that nobody asked for. all right so went to coach look Look at how big this bag is. It's unnecessarily big. Anyway, if you guessed that I got the Coach Lana bag, you would be correct. Um, I love this bag really because I just feel like it's gonna fit everything I need it to fit for the entire year. And it also has like a magnetic clasp in it. So basically when it closes, it snaps. There is like a zipper compartment inside of it that I could fit like, I don't know, my keys, my wallet and everything else because this is a bigger bag and it won't get lost. This is the difference between this and the Brooklyn. The Brooklyn doesn't really close, I don't believe. I think that was one of the reasons why I went with the Lana bag. But I also got accessories with it. I got two different accessories. So I have this, I'll put it in the screen so you guys can see it. I'm gonna put this on the Lana bag. This is super cute. They have this at Coach for like $100, I think it is. But this one right here is from Amazon for like $15. So if you wanted to get something very similar to what Coach has, literally almost looks just like this, check out my Amazon. Then I went and I also got the clogs here. And these are called like the Black Coach Rivet clogs. And I guess they, this, does this come back? No, it doesn't. I don't, I don't know if you're supposed to do that, but this is what the black shoes look like. They're very similar to the ones that have the CCs, but I just feel like I just bought some Uggs that literally are almost very similar to the brown. So I didn't want to get like two different brown things, but these are super cute and they're so comfortable. So I'm definitely going to be wearing these as well as a like fall staple and yeah that's my impromptu coach haul let me know in the comments down below what you guys think what y'all think about this bag though like i can't wait for this bag it's gonna be so perfect it's gonna be so perfect all right i'll talk to you later bye